least one of you is still awake down here. <sighs> I brought you your dinner. I guess I decided to be a little nice. Decided to give you some pasta for dinner. Well, don't worry about it. Just hoping you're still alive down here. Anyways, I'm going back upstairs. Enjoy your pasta. Hmm? You want to go back upstairs? No. Mm -mm. You're going to come back upstairs unless I tell you to. Until you're ready. Did those videos help you? been watching them all day and all night. They should have helped you. You had no sleep. You look like you've been scared. You're in a blank state. Did it actually work for you? What did you just say? I talked to any other woman, you would hurt me. <laughs> I think it worked. It worked. You're yondery like me. Good. I'm glad you are. You're something my love. Finally. Okay then, one more thing. Would you stuck me down in the basement? Or would you do something else? You throw me in a ditch. Until I learn my lesson. <laughs> That's exactly what I want to hear. You're definitely just like me. Oh yeah. You can come back upstairs. I'm sorry to have to do this to you. I'm glad you understand. I love you. Amazing. Now come on. We have a lot to talk about. A lot. Oh, you do want to have children. Good. I do too. I will be down to help. You know what I mean. <laughs> well, we have to get ready first, of course. Tonight. Will you be back? Okay then. I will um wait in the room. Will you freshen up in the bathroom? Alright. Cool. You ready? Almost. Well, I'm in the bed, so I'll be waiting for you. There you are. You look beautiful. You definitely do.
so for being parents we have a lot of responsibility you know that right of course we have a lot to teach them about mm-hmm Your earrings? Oh, you need them off the desk. Okay. No, I'll go get them. Let me get the... my back you tricked me come here I knew you were lying I should have known you do something stupid I knew I should have trusted you I should have kept you down in the basement like I should have. No, no. You're not going anywhere. Come here. You liar. You pathetic liar. We're married. We've been talking about having children. And that didn't work. Those, those I showed you didn't work. It still just made you crazy. Oh, it made you crazy to stay away from me. I'm your husband. <coughs> Come here. Get off me. I said, get out! As you get, fell down the stairs. Get up. I know you're playing with me. Get up. Hey. Get up. What? Why are you not getting up? You're playing with me. See if I pinch you, maybe you. <clears throat> if I stab you. It's a pulse. <laughs> No. No. I... No. What have I done? Why did I... Why did I do this? I... No. What have I done? You're the only person I loved. What was I doing? What was I doing? No. I did the same thing like my grand... My grandpa did. My grandfather did this. He actually killed her. I did the same thing. <sighs> No, no, I can't let you die. I can't. You're the only woman that I love. 
I can't let you die. I'm taking you to the hospital right now. You're in the hospital. Okay. You're in the hospital. Okay. How are you feeling? Just hurting. Please don't cry. Don't cry. Please don't cry. I, I'm I'm so sorry. I really am. I I shouldn't have done that. I was in the wrong. I killed you. But you're so lucky that you're still alive. I'm really sorry. <laughs> I really am. I'm just like my grandpa. He was crazy like me. He killed his own wife. And he, he didn't even care. At least I show some remorse. I'm so sorry. I really am. I'm sorry I've done all this to you. I should have been. I should have been much more greater husband for you. But I promise I won't ever do that again. You have to trust me. Please, just give me one more chance. I promise I'll be the best husband you've ever had. Please. What? You can't. Unless I know we can work this out. Me and you. What do you mean? Are those police sirens? You called the police on me? Why would you? You. Okay, okay, I have my hands in the air. I have my hands in the air. Why would you do this? <laughs> I. We will have a talk. Trust me. We'll have a talk afterwards. Afterwards! Hey. It's April now. It's been about a couple months. Well, instead of me being in jail, they decided to put me in an asylum instead. Mm hmm. I'm in a straitjacket just because I won't try to do anything. They know me here. And you know me here.
why did you do this? I loved you. I said I was sorry. And you're just breaking up with me, giving me a divorce. I can just punch you in the face right now. I'm sorry I didn't mean to say that. I <laughs> now I see why you did this. I just want me and you to have a good life. But I don't want this to end. Do you remember all the good stuff we've done? Everything. You know. It was really amazing. The day we first met. When we took our first picture. When we first kissed. I know I gave you some good memories. We were supposed to have children together. But you ruined it. No, no, I, 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 I don't know what to say. I know I did something wrong. I need help. And that's why I'm here, isn't it? <sighs> Tell me this. When I get the help that I need, will you come back with me? Please. If I'm a changed man, will you come back for me? Then we can get married again. I need you. There's no other good woman out there than you. This world is getting pathetic. Miserable. Because the people around it made it that way. If it wasn't for them, this world would be so much better. So much better. You know that, right? And this is what happens when you and another person with the opposite things you want from them to happen backfires on you. I'm miserable. I nothing without you I'm nothing without you no 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 don't let me go back I love you still <laughs> I'll be back I'll be back I'll be back! <laughs>